Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning has been released and so far it hasn't even ended this weekend well it depends when you see this video but worldwide has reached 122 million dollars 40 million domestic 82 international so basically this has been really great and uh, there will be spoilers on this review so please you've been warned please be uh, aware that that will be happening and if you don't want to be spoiled please check this video when you have watched the movie and if you have done so so basically you can still watch him this video so spoilers ahead Ethan Hunt is trying to stop this entity thing that is actually artificial intelligence AI who has become aware of its power basically it can control most part or basically all of the digital devices and at the end of the time there is this uh, Gabriel character from the past from Ethan Hunt past Gabriel killed one of the Ethan Hunt's friends on the first mission impossible and he has returned to serve this entity and to hunt Ethan <laughs> did, did you see what I did just there? okay anyways the thing is that um, after all of the Hollywood things that you will expect fightings chasings uh, big cars and trains blowing up and after well the reprisal of the death of another female colleague of Hunt in this case uh, one of the previous characters that we have seen on uh, the big screen on Mission Impossible was well basically what happened here is that we see Ethan struggling not to kill Gabriel and what happens is that uh, Gabriel, all of them are looking for a key that is divided into parts. This activates uh, or has access to a hardware and software that can deactivate the AI. And we'll see in part 2 how that evolves. Ethan gets the key and well, we'll see what happens next. But this is very important because recently it has to do with uh, strikes happening with the Actors and Writers Guild. Um, what happened here is that this is a critique, if you want, to the AI destroying the world. Maybe not on the, on the level that we are seeing in the movie, but with the jobs and everything that is happening and the people well, basically, if the AI takes over the world, uh, the economics and the world and everything, what is going to happen with all of the people that uh, will lose their jobs? What do you think about it? Share your thoughts down below. See you later. Bye.